for a while, we just kept saying three to six months. And it was because um, I think Albert and Kristen wanted six months, and I wanted three, and we kept saying three. So it's three. <laughs> it's three months. Um, and we come back in. Uh, essentially, because the, the story's gone public, we come back in with the press and then filling us in on the first hundred days since the assassination of the president and how the search for her assassin would go. That's, that's our end to the story. And Nikita's still on her own, and then we meet the team in the context of them either looking for her or trying to find the shop to clear her name. Proof she didn't do it. Is there any truth to the rumors that it might be presented as three two-hour movies? You know, I think that at one point I was fairly certain of that. Uh, although it wouldn't have been movies, it would be like a part one, part two. Okay. Like, that would definitely be enclosed so that they could air rerun separately. Now, I'm not sure. I'm really not. Uh, they, it, it's, I, I can tell you it's either going to be that or it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six. So, we'll see. Either way, it'll work. Have you already envisioned how each character is going to end their story? Um, pretty much. Maybe one or two that is still a little gross. Quite late. Has any, have any of the actors been kind of slyly pushing you like ideas like, hey, maybe I should be this, or, you know, it would be really great as if so-and-so was this. Yeah, you know, I, I think this season for the shortened thing, I haven't, I haven't gotten that. We had those discussions sort of at the, end, the beginning of last season, but, um, you know, now it's like, look, we only have six episodes, guys, we're just going to tell the story. <laughs> I hope you like it. Yeah. <laughs> How they never it, trust you by now. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> How was it writing to an end with six episodes? It's, it was great because that's where we started. Because you knew it was an end, like, like, let's not mess around. Let's figure out the last moment. And then let's figure out the moment before that. As opposed to, like, let's figure out the first moment. You know? Right. So we started at the end. Right. Getting back in the writing. So are the fans going to be happy with the ending, or are they going to be mad? Are they going to be... I wouldn't leave people mad. I know that. So I, I don't think they'll be mad. I don't get the point of leaving people unsatisfied. You know? It may not be exactly what they expect, but... But at some point in these six episodes, doesn't there have to be a big consultation between the kids? Yeah. Otherwise, it would be... Yes, there will be. I have no idea. Aaron mentioned that we will, might get a Burkhoff origin story. Um, is there any chance Percy might be involved in it? Percy is involved in it. I don't know if he's going to be involved on screen, but um, yeah, there's some Burkhoff origin stuff um, that's new, and the only person beside Burkhoff we know is Percy. Are we going to see any of the other actors come back? I'm, I'm, I'm working on it. <laughs> I, mean, I don't, there were some plans, and, and then when we got into it, we like, realized exactly how much story we had to tell. We're like, wow, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, you're saying that you know they're you know, working back backwards from knowing where you're going is a little bit, but is it kind of more freeing to be able to really concentrate everything down to a six episode portion? Yeah. No, knowing what your parameters are is is so is so key. Not knowing, like going if, if I was told it's six episodes, but if the ratings are good, maybe even more, that would be like I don't know what it is. So I don't know what that six episode would be. Like you could try to be, you know, so it's so much easier. Than that. And it, by the way, it would have been if they were if they were hundred percent on the two two energy. That would also be but now they're like, Michael, I think I think he's angry, but now it's three months later. So you're gonna see a guy who's had three months to think about it. And so it's not about I think it's happened enough times between the two of them where he's like he's gotta make up his mind to what to do. And you know what's all also he's gotta figure out is somebody posts a question to him early on in this season. It says because this season a lot is about identity a lot, uh, for for everybody. And someone says, Who are you without her? Do you even really know 
and it's kind of a question that he's got to answer. I'm sure he should for himself. We didn't learn his last name this season. Yeah, we. we, 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 we might, I mean, we know what it is. We know what it is for quite a while. It's so funny, and it's like it's it's fine. It's good last name, you know. But the fact that like everyone you know really wants to know, it's sort of like. <laughs> Right, I know. It's not. It's not going to be one of those. Yeah. So, how many like kind of random propositions did you guys throw out? Everything like um, it ends with everybody blowing up in a plane, or it ends with uh, Bobby coming out of the shower and it's all a dream. Like, how many of those kind of things did you just like throw out? There were really only two of them. I mean, I, I knew which one. I know kind of emotionally what I wanted to end with, with her. Um, and so, which is a very kind of quiet ending. Um, and so, I, uh, I sort of want to sort of try to see if we can build to that. And were you able to tell all the stories you wanted to? Well, I don't know if that's a good question. Are you happy with the amount of stories I guess you got to tell through Nikita and her family? Yeah. Yeah, I am. I mean, if we had 13 episodes, there may have been one or two more things we would have done that, like, we were talking about like, last year. There's not room to do it. You know, it would be cheesy if we tried to do it in six. So, uh, but they were, like, huge key things. She's not here, as I'm not fucking I, I know you're planning an ending, but is there any possibility of revisiting the Nikita universe someday? Um, you know, obviously, there have been too many examples lately for me to say never say never. You know, but I, I should say never, never, never say never because there's been the rest of the development. There's crazy stuff, you know. Um, and I you know, see shows live on in different ways. So, uh, yeah, there's always. Which always what are you proudest about your show? Um, I think, you know, one of the things I'm really proud about, it, some of the things that I'm proud about may not be the things that our parents are really proud about. Like, it's really our, sometimes when our crew is all working together and coming up with um, something that is, really looks good and is surprising to me. And it, it just came from everybody being on their, their game. Um, I'll give you an example, like in season two, we had we were in a rush to figure out a story, and Nikita had to get up. It was when she thought Ryan died. She was like ascending this building to take out the Wall Street bad guy. Mm -hmm. and we had written like she's got a grappling hook and she shoots it up, you know, <laughs> and, like goes to the top and like in the. And like, because that was the least of our worries right there. Mm -hmm. We were trying to figure out all this other stuff. And they were all, and the, the production crew was like, yeah, it's kind of cheesy. I don't know what, if she could shoot up that many stories. And we've kind of seen that before. And they came up with this thing of Nikita taking this device that hooks into the window washers grooves in the side of the building and using a, a motor in it to pull herself up that groove with her foot braced on it. And it looked really cool. And it was like, I was like, it was so much cooler than just that kind of. But that's the stuff that is, you know, that's like I remember. You know,